It's that classic battle, Can-Am versus Polaris, and third outright, and probably should have been first, I've got to say. Michael Guest and David Green, well done, mate. I know you won't be happy with third. You've shown some awesome pace. That's got to be coming soon. Yeah, look, I, we're definitely not, not happy with that. We had a great win yesterday, and I think we had the opportunity to do it again today. And I think the biggest issue we had was probably the turnaround time from Fink Desert Race. Uh, we spoke about it yesterday. We had two days to turn around, and I'm sure 183 kilometres of Fink that we did punishing the exhaust has had some issues. So we've broken the exhaust once, it broke again. Uh, anyone who knows anything about turbochargers, when, when you don't have that exhaust gas spinning that impeller, that wheel, then you have no pressure, then we're back. It's even worse than a normally aspirated car. So that really costs us big time. And then, uh, you know, we're chasing Cody. Cody and, and both Lee and, and Cody set some fantastic pace today. And that's what racing's all about. I really enjoyed that. And I actually enjoyed the challenge this afternoon of running him back down. I think we could have done it, but unfortunately uh, the belt let us down. Bit of a shame because you're getting there and it's a big step up from last year. This is a really good machine to be in, isn't it? Absolutely. Like last year, we were really up against it. We were trying 110% to come second all the time. This year, same amount of effort and we're putting the times down. So, fingers crossed, Coffs Harbour, it's going to be good for us. Yeah. And the thing is, we love the battle. I keep saying it to Cody and everyone, you drive them flat out. I mean, it's just, that's what you want, though. You want a battle and you've got a great machine under you now. Oh, look, look I think definitely, Dean. And you listen to people who are out watching and they, they you know, they're shocked by the speed. And, uh, you know, I've driven a lot of cars, everything from World Rally Cars, Super 2000, rear-wheel drive, front-wheel drive, you name it, Group N. And, and I know how fast we're going here. And even with David, certainly in the technical twisty sections where it's not, it's not a high top speed, he's having to call the notes no differently if you're in a Super 2000 car on Evo 9 because it's how quick they're coming up and you look at the outright times we're doing are just sensational and the big thing is with Can-Am and Polaris is the evolution is happening so quickly I, I hate to think how fast we'll be going in another couple of years. Nathan Shivers and Peter Harris congratulations Can-Am second outright great job by you guys. Yeah, thanks Dino yeah no I had a good time out there and a bit of a shame for Guesty he was doing really well he should have had it in the bag but had a mechanical so that's the way it goes and yeah fortunately we just puddled along and come in and got the second. Peter, he says puddling along. I don't think it's like that in the passenger seat, is it? No, no. But some of those creek crossings where you got a nice, uh, nice cleansing bath a couple of times. It's, uh, but uh, yeah, look, it was a fantastic weekend. Yeah, the, the roads uh, uh, for the rain that we had last week held up very, very well. And um, you know, all credit to uh, all the officials are out there in those conditions. It's fantastic. Most certainly, Nathan, you're getting more and more experience with the pace notes on these rally roads. What is it like in this machine? Tell me what it's like. It is fun, yeah, that's no other way to describe it. I've, um, I've got my suspension finally set up pretty much how I want it. I'm nice and low now and you can just really throw it in and commit a bit more and the Can-Am Mavericks just got all the torque, all the horsepower now, so we've got the machine. Um, it's just, just a matter of me just practicing with my notes and getting used to that power. And the winners of the side-by-side -side for International Rally Queensland, Cody Crock and Greg Folletta. What a great job in the side-by-side. -side. Cody, I've got to say it again, can and probably had your measure, but hey, a win's a win. Awesome job. Yeah, they do, and they've, you know, they've upped their pace a lot this year, and uh, managed, we've managed to actually be on top of them. So we're happy with that, and we'll take it while we can. We're going to get every point we possibly can, because I know coming to the end of the year, we're halfway there now, we're, uh, we're going to have a big fight. Greg, but you want a scrap, don't you? At the end of the day, you don't want it all easy. This is a great battle between two great brands, isn't it? Yeah, it's uh, like last year we had the measure, and this year, they've, like Cody said, they've got a little bit of an advantage. But I think uh, we did some homework between the last rally and this one, and we managed to peg it back to probably half a second a K. So it's getting close. We've got a bit more homework we can do before the next one. And um, Ian also, Ian Hughes and the other Polaris, he was doing really great times yesterday. So the three of us were basically neck on neck. So it's, it's a good competition. We just need a few more people to come in and have some yeah. fun with us, eh? It looks like fun, but I've got to say, I'd be worried about how fast you have to drive these cars. Cody, you've got so much experience, championships under your belt. You're driving as hard as ever. It's unbelievable. Yeah, absolutely. And the great thing we've got is a backing of a manufacturer to actually go and do the development that we can do with this and actually use this, them as support for, for getting the best things we can. And then we can go absolutely flat out and push as hard as we can. And believe me, we're pushing it. It's, and it's awesome. You, know, you don't want to have that just drive along finish. It's, uh, you've got to earn it there. So it's, uh, it's awesome fun. That's why the winds feel so good. Well done, guys. Congratulations. Hey. Thanks, <laughs> Thanks.